<laughs> hey, now, don't, don't use that kind of language. You this a family show now. You ain't family. So what do you do? I run the motherfucking church, stud. Run in the church and run in the round. <laughs> <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> Get a car. Okay, hang on just one second. Jesse, you like that Tesla? Take it, okay? It's too complicated anyway. Don't even take gas. No, no, no. Need about the gift. I just wanted to ask you, did you happen to get the very formal email that I sent you? It started with, Dear Eli, comma, and um, the body of it said a bunch of stuff about how I was begging you for a chance. No <laughs> Thank you, Martin. I'm talking to my daddy right now. I'm not talking to you. Damn, can you shut up for once in your fucking life? Judy! You will not talk to Martin that way. What's gotten into you? Just why didn't you write me back? I'm in the middle of a meeting here. I'm not dealing with this right now. Uh, Judy, sheesh. We're doing real work here. Why don't you go restock the church office supplies or something? Right? Yeah, I probably should do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get on out. What the fuck? Stop it! No. Stop it! No. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! No. I won't have you idiots act like this here! Judy, no. Judy, this is why you're not asked to speak. This right here! I'm hearing this, and I'm processing it, and I'm just thinking, the only way we put this to an end, Daddy, is if I go seduce this man. You know, get some intel through turn-ons, <laughs> handholds, eye contacts, jack him off just a little bit. No. What we're gonna do is zip our lips, like I said. Well, I'm just gonna go on record saying I think it'd be better if Judy at least jacked this spell off than do nothing at all. Daddy, I could just get him hungry. I was just this... thinking that, Daddy. <laughs> He's right. Yeah, nice work, Dr. Tits. Your little bag party is a shit show. Ta-ta for now. <laughs> yeah. The bomb has been dropped. Woo! Huh. Okay, I knew it. I'm sitting here going, I know something's weird, and now I know it. That's why your whole jug is out. I understand. I thought this was happening. Y'all are running game. Her jugs are just out because this is what they normally are doing. <laughs> yuck. Yuck, Jesse. What y'all are doing right now is gross. Mm. I'm not good at relationship stuff. That's what I'm figuring out. Because all my ideas and my thoughts about it are from teen movies. Judy, that's not true. You've had plenty of lovers. BJ, I haven't gobbled a thousand cocks like you think I have. I was trying to impress you. What? I've only had one boyfriend before you. You never told me that. I thought you'd fucked a million guys. I know. And you loved it when I said that. But the truth is, I've had one boyfriend and... His name was Dr. Warren Carmichael, and he was my economics professor, and he was 56 years old, and he was very smart, and he dressed like a casual beach man. Let's just say I knew what he meant, okay? Full lightning bolt through my slit. When class was over, there were snail trails on my chair. Like, no one should have sat in that chair after me. It was damp. <laughs> Butterflies. Butterflies, they start as caterpillars. And the caterpillars, they change into butterflies. BJ, the Christian, the fart! <laughs> My dominance or don't, doesn't matter to me. The damn tides of time and the winds of dust are upon us. My reign is nigh. What the fuck did you even just say, man? That made no sense to me. That sounded foreign. That's not a phrase, dummy. <laughs> oh, nah. my God. You're just both a bunch of two-bit, half-rate siblings. Uh -huh. Damn. Oh, Lord. Y'all went down to Disney World, didn't invite any family to come to your wedding, and you didn't even get a legacy character to marry. What well, legacy character are we supposed to go for that's better than Prince Eric? Oh, I don't know. How about Mickey Mouse? Man, fuck Mickey. Enough! Judy, I don't want to discuss the mermaid wedding. Sorry. Maybe this family has become an abomination. 
Daddy, slap me too. I'm gonna jump on too, so slap my face. Daddy, that man is not cute. Call me crazy. I always hoped if you were gonna yank a pole, it'd be somebody hot, like a Patrick Stewart type. Well, maybe next time you'll think twice before barging into my home on and out. No family. No kids. Ooh, slam. I like that one. I don't got time for kids. Cause I'm trying to keep this fresh physique fine. I'm not trying to be all loose and stretched out like Amber's played out for Strami. Hey, dummy, what can you play? Huh? What can you play, dummy? Oh. Um, I can play this little lot of mine and Toxic. Both great. Pick one.